The Durham Research Center 2 at the University of Nebraska Medical Center is attracting the world's best medical scientists to UNMC. These researchers are tackling the toughest challenges to ensure a vibrant future for Nebraska and beyond. Funding for the $76.4 million facility came largely through private support. The late Chuck Durham provided the lead gift and was an ardent supporter of UNMC. Both the Durham Research Center II and the Durham Research Center, which opened in 2003, are named for Durham. He felt that uh, he could do more for people, for humanity, through research than through any other mechanism. He was a real visionary. And if you looked at uh, what he had done for the state of Nebraska, it, is, it was absolutely amazing. Durham's stamp of approval helped to convince others that UNMC was a sound investment. Other principal benefactors' gifts have helped propel UNMC to the forefront of research, education, and patient care. That's why we've been able to uh, build towards becoming a world-class academic health sciences center because of the contributions of these visionary people who are very generous with their hard-earned monies. They want us to do great things for the state of Nebraska. In the DRC2, physicians, scientists, and public health experts will collaborate to tackle some of the most perplexing diseases of our time. They will join other medical scientists across the campus in improving the health of the citizens of Nebraska and people across the world. The University of Nebraska Medical Center is poised to move into all of the important areas of research in the 21st century, and they would include specialized medicine based on the Human Genome Project, uh, new antibiotics, uh, regenerative medicine. Um, those are the areas that are going to save lives, they're going to prevent disease. I'm actually as optimistic as I've ever been about anything about UNMC research in the 21st century.